quite weird why I started the core module really, why I chose to take part in it. Uh, firstly, I'm a GCA, so that means I don't have to do it unlike some lecturers, there's no real requirement. But as a GCA and as a student rep, I thought that GCAs to actually have the right to take part in it, because it wasn't actually available to us GCAs. So really on the basis of being able to take part, I had to do it. I couldn't fight it to get on it and then not do it myself. Uh, also, once to go into academia, it's one of the main steps in getting a, a teaching qualification that enables you to teach in higher education. So I thought that was a, a necessary requirement. Now, I know some people will say, oh, if you get a teaching job, you have to do it, and wherever your job is, they'll put you through it. But surely, if you've already got it before you go into the actual role, it puts you in a better stead than perhaps other people that you're competing against. So from an early career perspective, that's got to be a positive. Uh, regarding the actual core module, it wasn't quite what I expected in terms of a lot of it was reflective practice, you know, it made you think exactly why you're doing things. And to some extent, I would have liked it to be more theory. Now, saying that, the lack of theory is probably a blessing the fact that it made me go away and read around areas myself, then have the opportunity to discuss it in class, which ultimately is the PG CAPS teaching us in a um, student-led role is the way it should be. And so I refer to that to being a student and completely see both perspectives.